Right now in this very cold and strong wind, there are concerns about people working outside. And that cold wind, those chills could cause frostbite on exposed skin in as little as 30 minutes. And TV6's Caden Minus speaks to two Marquette agencies about how they keep employees safe from these elements. After the weekend snowstorm, wind chill values have dropped well below zero. Marquette Board of Light and Power journeyman lineman Johnny Betts says the fresh snow and frigid temps have kept his crew busy, but they are prepared for these conditions. We definitely have some cold gear. Um, we have to wear specialized equipment with FR clothing. Um, so we definitely have layers out there. Uh, it's a little harder when we wear our rubber gloves and sleeves, but we have to make sure that we take shifts, work with each other, and we always got to keep an eye out for each other. Beth says some conditions require work to be postponed. He explains that it's up to workers' discretion if a job is too risky. Once we start to get to that 30 mile an hour winds and higher, there's only so much we can do with a bucket truck. Uh, that's also very dangerous when we get that off the ground, and the higher the winds, the uh, less probability we are of actually being in that bucket. Marquette Police Corporal James Britton says this time of year can be unpredictable. He says police officers may have to find a balance between warm and cold. And you could have some sort of bad accident or you could have a power outage where we're out directing traffic at an intersection that is usually controlled by a, a signal and we're out there until BLP or somebody comes to fix the light. But then there's days where it's slow. Britain also says if you're going to be working outside in these conditions to bring layers you can take off and put back on. Cade Minus, TV6 News, Marquette.